Hi, welcome to the Magic of Math, where today we're going to practice some math test prep where we answer questions about circumference and area of circles. Here's our question today. This question has two parts. A circle has a radius of 6 meters as shown. Part A, which of the following is closest to the circumference in meters of the circle? And use 3.14 for pi. And here are your four answer choices. So I'd like you to pause the video now and come back and hit play when you're ready to check your work. Welcome back. So we know that we've been given that this circle has a radius of 6 meters, and here it is labeled in the picture in the diagram. We're asked to find which one of these values is closest to the circumference of the circle, noticing that it says closest because it's been rounded to the nearest tenth. So we're going to look for the circumference, and we're going to use 3.14 for pi. So I'm going to begin by writing the formula for circumference. C is equal to 2 multiplied by pi multiplied by r, the radius. That is equal to the circumference. You could have also used the formula pi times diameter. Today, this is what I'm going to use. So we're going to go and identify that pi is being used as 3.14 in this problem and r, our radius, is 6 meters. So I'm going to replace pi with 3.14 and r with 6 from the diagram. So when you multiply 2 multiplied by 3.14 multiplied by 6, on your calculator you're going to get 37 and 68 hundredths. Now each one of these is rounded to the nearest tenth, so I'm going to look at the hundredths digit. Seeing as it is 5 or greater, we're going to round up so it's going to be 37.7 rounded to the nearest tenth, and that is answer choice B. Here's part B of our question. What is the area in square meters of the circle? Go ahead and pause your video now and come back and hit play when you're ready. Welcome back. So we're finding area, and our area formula of a circle is a is equal to pi multiplied by r squared. So in this case, pi, we're still going to leave it pi. We're not going to replace it with 3.14 like we did in part a because all of our answer choices are in what we call terms of pi. So we need to find r and square it. r is 6 meters. So pi times 6 squared 6 squared is 6 times 6, which is 36. And then when we write that 36 times pi, we can see that our answer is C. And there you have circumference and area of a circle. I thank you for joining me today at The Magic of Math, where we continue to master math one video at a time. I hope you'll come back soon and have a great day.